Amen. Glory to God. Make Amen. sure you play this on your website. Amen. Tony Harvin. Make sure you play this. Now you want to know why I won't eat catfish and pork and hog and all that stuff. Right. Listen at the Bible. Not that I think the devil is in it. No. The devil's in people. That's right. Listen. Romans chapter 14, first at verse 3. Follow me. <clears throat> Let not him that eateth despise him that eateth not. Now. <clears throat> Let not him that eateth despise him that eateth not. I don't eat catfish, but I do eat fish. Mm -hmm. I'm very particular of the size chicken I eat. Amen. My wife know if I eat chicken, I like little party parts. Mm -hmm. Or the, what you call them, chicken tenders? Yeah. I don't want drumsticks that look like I can knock a tree down with. <laughs> Amen. That's me. That's, that's right. Now, there's some on a drumstick that look big enough to jack up a car Amen. and change the tire. <laughs> that's them. That's them. That's right. Listen. Let not him that eateth despise him that eateth not. Let not him that eateth despise him that don't eat. And let not him which eateth not. Let not him that eateth not. Judge him that eateth. Judge him that eateth. That do eat. For God hath received him. Who did? God hath received him. What if God hath received the eaters and the those that eat not? Right. Who are you? That's right. That's right. Why? Because the kingdom of God is not centered around food. In Romans chapter 14 and at verse 17. Listen. For the kingdom of God is not meat. The meat. Meat. At verse 20, for meat destroy not the work of God. Amen. Small word. Hmm. Meat don't destroy the work of God. No, no. No, no. Meat don't affect God's work at all. Not at all. That's right. Why? Because the work of God is built by the Spirit and not by meat. That's right. That's right. Listen. For meat destroy not the work of God. Destroy not the work of God. All things indeed are pure. All things. All things. You see, we know Moses' law was good mm -hmm. for that time. That's right. But it wasn't good enough. That's right. So when folk walk around and say that the devil is in the hall, the devil's in people. Amen. And still is. Still is. That's right. That's right. Meat does not hinder. No. Or bring a flaw. No, no. In the prophets or the apostles. That's right. Listen. For meat destroy not the work of God. Yes. All things indeed are pure. All things indeed are pure. But it is evil for that man who eateth with offense. It is evil for that man for that who man. eat with offense. It is good neither to eat flesh. It is good neither to eat flesh. Nor to drink wine. Nor to drink wine. Nor anything whereby thy brother stumbleth, or is offended, or is made weak. See, if those things cause you to stumble. Right. Or those things make you weak. Mm -hmm. Stay away from it. That's right. Are you listening? That's right. Stay away from it. Mm -hmm. So that's the reason why I don't eat catfish. That's right. I have brothers here that eat catfish. They love it. Love it. Mm -hmm. You ask me, why don't I tell them not to do it? No, the Bible didn't tell me to tell them not to do it. No. Didn't say. The Bible says, eat whatsoever. Mm hmm. It's sold in the shambles. In the shambles. That's right. And shambles mean market. Market. Mm -hmm. Eat whatsoever. Whatsoever. Listen at the Bible. In 1 Corinthians chapter 10 and at verse 25. One scripture says every creature of God is good. Good. That's right. And it is to be received. Mm -hmm. We're straightening you out on that too. Yes. Listen at the Bible. 1 Corinthians chapter 10 and at verse 25. What is it? Whatsoever is sold in the shambles. That eat asking no question for conscience sake. For the earth is the Lord's. What? Whatsoever is sold in the shambles. The earth belong to who? For the earth is the Lord's and the fullness thereof. Everything in the earth. Everything. That came into existence, that mm -hmm. breathed. Mm -hmm. That's flesh and blood. That's right. 
God made. That's right. Listen at the Bible. Also in 1 Timothy chapter 4, begin reading at verse 2. See, we deal with Bible. That's right. And that's what upset people. Mm -hmm. Because they want me to give my opinion. I'm not giving nothing. I'm going to give Bible. The Bible, amen. If you don't want to eat pork, fine. That's right. Fine. That's right. You not eating pork don't make you no righteous than the other. No. No, it doesn't. Here's a man don't eat pork, but the same man smoke. <laughs> amen. Some say, I want to foul my body with, with pork and like that. Right. But you defile your body with fornication. That's right. That's right. What did you do? Lay with some pork? <laughs> <laughs> amen. Are you listening? I won't eat chitlins and all that. All right. Fine. Mm -hmm. You won't defile yourself eating chitlins. Mm -hmm. But would you defile yourself with a woman or a man? Right. That's it. Defilement is defilement. That's right. Listen. First Timothy chapter 4, begin reading at verse 2. At, verse, me. at verse 1. All right. Now the Spirit speaketh expressly. That ah, ah, that's the difference here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. that's, that's a big difference. difference. That's right. Spirit is talking. God's talking. Mm -hmm. That what? Now the Spirit speaketh expressly. God is expressing himself through Scripture. That in the latter times some shall depart from the faith. Some shall depart from the right belief. Giving heed to seducing spirits. Seducing spirits. And doctrines of devils. And doctrines of devils. Now, mm -hmm. don't misunderstand me. If someone got high blood, it'd be foolish of them to go eat and pork and they know it mess up their blood. That's right. If beef don't agree with your system, don't eat it. Don't eat it. Amen. If chicken don't agree with your system, mm -hmm. don't eat it. Shrimp don't too much agree with mine. Right. I don't want to bother with shrimp. Mm -hmm. It is not because I don't want to eat no shrimp. I should advise them not to eat no shrimp. You no. can eat all the shrimp you want. That's right. I don't want no lobster. It looks too ugly. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> it looks too ugly. <laughs> Some folks say you don't know what you're missing. Well, perhaps, but <laughs> still ugly. It's still ugly. <laughs> Amen. Now, because I don't eat it, are the devil in the claws? Right. No, no. <laughs> Amen. Are right, you listening? Amen. Listen. Giving heed to seducing spirits and doctrines of devils. What is it? Speaking lies in hypocrisy, having their conscience seared with a hot iron, uh -huh. forbidding to marry, yes. and commanding to abstain from meat. And what kind of doctrine is that called? Doctrines of devils. And what does the doctrine of devils teach? Commanding to abstain from meats. You hear the Bible talking? Forbidding to marry and commanding to abstain from meats, which God hath created. Which God hath created to be received, to with, be thanksgiving received with thanksgiving of them which believe and know the truth. For every creature, how much? Every creature, every creature of God is good. Of God is good. And nothing to be refused. What? If it be received. If Here's the terms. If. If it be received. With thanksgiving. For it is sanctified by the word of God and prayer. I take what the Bible say any day. That's right. That's right. Don't go telling me a white man put that in there. Amen. Amen. Tony Harvin. He loved this program. Thank God. He, he, he fills this program up on his website. Points the people to the truth of God.